Yes, if Posh isn't looking, let's see if we can try to burn his private chest down. What? 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 Fire alarm? What? Surprise? Ah, what? Hey, what is up, guys? The Post of Bikira, and welcome back to another awesome mod review where today I'm reviewing the Mr. Crayfish Furniture Mod. This mod is crazy awesome, so I suggest you all install it and make sure if you would like to know how to install it, make sure to click the link in the description as always and it will take you to my very own easy under five minutes um, video on how to install this awesome mod. So let's get right into it. Hey Sir Posh, he's gonna be joining me and we're gonna we're gonna do some fun stuff. So <clears throat> we had this little we have all our furniture set up back here because we're having a yard sale, right, Sir Posh? Wasn't that the deal? I think we're having a yard sale because all Sir Posh's junk needs to get out of our house. But before I do, I just want to show you guys all this awesome furniture that you can get in this mod. So let's start at the beginning. Well, first we have we have wooden tables, you know, just nice little nice little tables. The crafty recipes I'm not gonna be showing you because they're they're pretty basic and you can look them up anyway in the links in the description. So we have our nice little wooden tables, we have wooden chairs that you can sit in. So you can just sit there and be like, yeah, 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 eat my food, eat my food, right, right? You know, wait, whoa. That was weird. Anyway, we have a little cabinet right here where you can store your stuff because it's just cool. We have a bed drawer, which is like this is a bedside cabinet, I believe. Yes, a bedside cabinet. You can put this next to your bed and store your stuff. We have some low, like some coffee tables that are like tables lower to the ground. So that's fun. We actually have a refrigerator. And the refrigerator has a special use. If you grab yourself, if you have too much rotten fr flesh, right? You know, you can put it in, in the fridge. And then if you also grab some coal coal, you can um, turn your rotten fr flesh, I believe. Is that not how it works? Is there ice? There's probably ice. Do I have to put ice in? Okay, well, I'm mistaken, guys. This is what I... This is how it used to be, wasn't it? Yeah, there we go. Ice, and it will turn into uh, some nice food that you can eat. So that is handy. You can, you know, have your stuff in here, and then it will um, give you flesh. So you can cook that, and... I mean, you can eat that, and it will be way better than eating rotten flesh. Anyway, we have these hedges. We have different kinds of hedges, and these are cool. They're like gates. You can't jump up here. You can't jump over them, so I'm just jumping and jumping and jumping, and you cannot jump over them. We have some stone paths to, like, decorate outside your little your little place. We have a bird bath over here, you know, which is cool. Hold on, I just want to switch that. It's annoying. We have a little bird bath, so if you had birds in Minecraft, they could come in your bath. We have a faucet, which doesn't do anything. It says that, but it doesn't actually... I've tried it, but, um, we have these white fences, which are really cool. This is like regular fences, except they're white, and they look a lot nicer. We have a mailbox, and this is pretty cool. Like, you can put your stuff in your mailbox. You're actually supposed to get what they have is a letter, an envelope, or a package. And what you can do is you can open the envelope, put some stuff in it, sign it, and then you can put it in someone's mailbox. Also, you can't destroy it. You need to crouch and right-click it to unlock it before you can destroy it. So... Posh, what are you doing? What are you doing? So, um, this is a computer. This is really awesome. You can actually buy stuff on Mine Bay. So, let's see. One iron will will give you one bottle of enchanting. Five iron will get you a bunch of wood and so on and so forth. And you can buy what? That's crazy. You can buy all sorts of awesome stuff. And it can cost emeralds and diamonds. And it's really, really cool. We have a printer. Not exactly sure what this does, um, but yeah, we have a we have a lamp. I believe this should work. You have to, yeah, yeah. This is lit up, so you have to either power it by redstone or put it on a bedside cabinet for it to work, and then you can turn it on and off. If we come over here, we have a TV where we can watch this show, that show, or that show. And I'm not really sure which one's the best, but you can just change the channels by right clicking, and that is awesome. We also have a radio. Where we can, oh, there we go, where we can listen to music. You just change it by right clicking, and then you can turn it off by shift right clicking. We have blinds where you can put like in front of your door. Ah! Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, you freak me out so bad. Sir Posh, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Kill it. Thank you. But um, we have these, you can put them over your, like, your glass panes and close them, and then the sun won't get in. We have a doorbell. 
It's pretty cool. We have a light, a ceiling light you can turn on and off. And then we have the fire alarm, which you saw in the beginning of the video. Which what it would do is detect fire around it and alert you. So, yep. And then you can right click it to turn it off. I, I don't know, actually. How do we turn it off? Will it turn off automatically? There we go. You should right click and turn it off after the fire is gone. Now, moving on, we have electric fences. So, if we go on game mode zero and we touch this fence. Ow! Ouch! That is really hurtful. Um, boom! Yeah, so they will kill mobs and yourself. Like, I just died right there. So, pause. Hey, let's get my stuff. So, they'll kill mobs and yourself. Someone was electrocuted by. <laughs> was killed by an electric fence. That is awesome. I just thought it was like someone. But anyway, let's turn this Nyan Cat off and just turn it, the TV off. I'm too mad. Anyway, um, over here we have some other things such as a toilet. Where it's just because if if you've known this mod before, this has gotten a big update and it has the bathroom update. So if you go on it, you can press F and pretty disgusting, but you know whatever makes you happy. <laughs> This is a sink, and you, it says you need to put a source block of water under the basin, or you can fill it with a bucket. Ah! But the source block under the thing doesn't really seem to work at all, so if you fill it with a bucket, there you go, but you can't really do anything with it. We have some bathroom cabinets right here, so you can open them up and put your stuff inside. You know, pretty cool. Toothbrush. You can't put that inside. Wait, what can you put inside? Is there, like, special stuff you can put inside? Can you only put, like, food inside? I'm not sure. I actually didn't know that you couldn't put anything inside there. They don't have toothbrushes, do they? Nope. That's interesting. Here we have a shower. There we go. We can go inside. La -da 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 -da! Singing of the shower. Yes, but it's it's cool. I mean, it doesn't like wash mud off you, but I mean, you know, why not? Where'd my water bucket go? That is rude. Here's a bathtub. We can fill it up. We have to keep right clicking and fill all the way up. But you can't really do anything with it anyway, so that's... Well, you can get in, I guess, and pretend like you're taking a bath. La -da 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 -da. Here we have a bin, which is like a trash can. You can put your stuff inside, press empty, and it will all disappear. But if you don't press empty, it won't, like, it won't take them away. So you can just leave all your stuff in there forever. But if you never press empty, then it will stay in there forever. So that is kind of handy. You can just get rid of your stuff real fast. Or you could leave it in there in case you want to change your mind. Here we have a Christmas tree for Christmas. Sirposh, kill the skeleton. Sirposh, kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Do it now. Yes. Yes. Oh, he shot you. No. Sirposh, kill it. I'll help. Punch. There, it died. Here, I got a bow so I can protect us next time. So, watch out. Oh, that was awesome. But anyway, let's not get sidetracked. Um, we have these presents. Empty presents. Now, what you can do is you can right-click with these and put stuff inside it. Right? And then you press wrap, and it has a wrap present. You can put it on the ground, and when someone breaks it, it says Merry Christmas from the poster pig, and you get a bunch of the things that he put inside. So that's fun. Go away. Go away. No one likes your face. Anyway, we have an oven, which is actually really cool. It costs like eight blocks of iron. So I know most of you are like, ah! But it's actually really awesome. It will cook food forever with no fuel needed. All at once. That's awesome. This thing on top is an oven overhead. Doesn't really matter, I don't think. But, um, like, you don't need fuel anymore to cook your food. That's the basis of it. You can cook it all at once for free. So that's cool. We'll check on that back and that later. It takes a little longer, but it is cooking nine pieces at once. Here we have some couches. You can sit on them. And we have different colors. And then we have... That's it. That's it, guys. That's pretty much it. Look. Oh, it cooks them one at a time. Okay, so it is, it is very significantly slower, guys. But I, if I was starting a mod pack or something, I would definitely put this in because... That's free coal, literally. I'm not sure. I doubt you can put in other stuff that is not, um, let's see if we can put in an ore, if that'll work. Um, let's get an ore that you can smelt. I don't think an ore, yeah. An ore looks like it's not gonna work, but I don't care. That is literally, that is free stuff. That is free stuff, and you might know that I'm a big fan of free stuff. So that's pretty much it, guys, for this mod. This mod is really awesome. It has a bunch of capabilities, and it is being updated because they recently added in the bathroom. So, yeah. <laughs>
Let's just not. Let's just not. Okay. I'm get. I'm. I'm feeling sick listening to that. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Make sure to also check out my other video on how to install this. Very simple. Very easy. Link in the description. And yeah, I'm gonna see you guys next time. Goodbye.